Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today is Thursday, so it means a new Combine Warrior player, and I'm happy about this player. I know most people aren't, but I'm happy about it, and I know most people aren't going to want to get it, so he's going to be cheap, so that makes it even better for me. Uh, and so the player is Trendon Holiday, uh, one of my favorite players in the entire NFL, definitely my favorite kick and punt returner. Uh, but here are the cards that are in his collection, the three that are exclusive to him. The Holiday Juke Move, Holiday Elusiveness, and Holiday Ball Carrier Vision. Um, and then the ones that are just general, uh, I think there's six of them. Awareness, Acceleration, Speed, Agility, Strength. Is that it? That might be it. I think that's it. Um, elusiveness. No, I think Elusiveness. I th well, I don't know. I don't know, I think there's five or six. Uh, and the three of them for this one is Agility, Speed, and Acceleration. Uh, there's the Combine Workout trend in Holiday. And I will show you guys his highest overall card. Uh, so you can get one that gives you plus two to speed and ball carrier vision, or one that gives you the plus two to acceleration and elusiveness. Both pretty good. That's better than the uh, Peterson the man defense is good. I like that, but the press and speed is so much better, so I don't I don't really know. They could have done better with the Pat Pete. Uh, so first, let's go over uh, the new trend in holiday card. I'm not going to go over his collectibles because there's no real point. They're all pretty darn high for him. Uh, but there is the acceleration elusiveness one. Up for 88k, and there's the speed and ball carrier vision one that's up for 110k. So if I flip him over, he's got 98 speed, so if the boost applies to himself, he's got 100 speed as soon as you put this card in. Uh, agility is 96, awareness is 88, running is 88, catching is 94, catching traffic is 87, 90 spec catch and 89 release. If he, could have, if he had 90 something release, all you'd have to do is send him on a streak, and he would burn most corners uh, other than Pat Pete and Dion or a super upgraded Charles Woods and something like that. Uh, but Patrick Peterson is on the rise coin wise. He's up to 140 K uh, not on huge rise. He was about 130 last night. So, but he's going up because they did take the Patrick Peterson collectibles out of packs, which makes me really happy. Uh, and you'll see why, uh, but hopefully he gets up high. I'm going to hold on. Uh, for just a little while, probably at least early next week. Uh, I've got three Combine Warrior Patrick Peterson, one Agility and Man Coverage, and two Speed and Press. Um, I'm probably going to end up keeping one of the Speed and Press ones unless the card gets up over 200k, which then I'll sell it because it's not worth that much to me. Uh, but as of right now, I've got three, and I'm looking for around 200k for him uh, if I can't get that if I can only get like 160 or something like that I'll take it uh, but I'm looking for around 180 to 200 um, or 200 plus I'm willing to wait a while for it too I, I don't need the coins um, because my team is I'm really happy with my team so I'm not gonna really rush and push uh, just to get rid of the cards to get rid of them I might even run them as three corners just for the time being but I wanted to throw them on my trade block so I could show you guys uh, make them a little bit more organized but I'm gonna send them back to my actives now but yeah that's gonna do it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed uh, let me know if you guys want the trend in the holiday if you are looking to get them like I am or if you just think it's a terrible card and that you're just waiting for the next combine warrior to come out but let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you all later. Peace out, guys.